did you kill your wife? Yes, I did. You heard it there. A Las Vegas man admits he murdered his wife three days ago. Fox News' Kyla Gaylor talked to the man in jail today. Kyla, you also talked to his wife's friends and co-workers. Dana Benkin was a car sales agent. Her co-workers told me she was strong, outgoing, and a wonderful mother. They said it feels surreal. They can't believe they won't see her again. Her husband didn't have the same emotion. He told me part of the reason he killed her? Revenge. Did you kill your wife? Yes, I did. Slobodan Mijas admitted he killed his wife, Dana, and he's not sorry. Do you regret what you did? No, not really. He told me he beat Dana to death with a baseball bat Friday evening. You knew from the second you grabbed it you wanted to kill her? Yes. Well, why did you do it? There was a lot of reason, you know. Slobodan said his wife lied to him. Lying about the private life, you know, and lying about the cheating and lying about everything, you know. She's always working and working and working, never home, never watch the kids, never do nothing for the kids, you know. I do the, all the dishing, I do all the cooking. I believe that she was trying to stay away from home. Away from Slobodan. And sometimes she would want to bring her kids to work. Jeremiah's friendship with Dana started as co-workers two years ago. Without Dana, I wouldn't have been the car rental agent that I have become today. It evolved into nights out on the town and carpooling home from work. She was very outgoing, fun. She was very motivating. Uh, she was a hard worker. Jeremiah told me he knew Dana and her husband fought, not to what extent. I didn't know it was physical. Now, I didn't know that they did argue a lot. They had a lot of issues. Uh, she was actually in the process of getting divorced. Dana and Slobodan have two boys, 13 and 6. Oh my gosh, she loved her children. The 13-year-old came home Friday afternoon and found his dad lying next to his motionless mother. Police said he ran down the street and called 911. Are you worried about the kind of impact this is going to have on your 13-year-old who was home, who came home to that to see his mom? Yes. I wish you don't see nothing, but he did. The only time Slobodan showed emotion during our interview was when he talked about his boys. I hope he's gonna love him. Are you worried about them? Yes, I do, very much. Now they have to I grow up I without a mother. Yes. Now they're gonna grow up without a father too. A father who admits to killing his children's mother for revenge. If my father won't want to stick his nose but it doesn't belong, it will never happen. Absolutely not. Was this revenge to her family and her father? Not to her family, just to her father. Can you tell us what he did? No, I don't need to tell you nothing, you know. But when he, when he watch the news, he, he will know and he will understand. I just got off the phone with Dana's sister. I told her what Slobodan said about their father. She said he's a monster and he is lying. She told me her dad is a good person. He was actually living with Dana and the kids, helping them out. He now has custody of the boys. Kyla Gaylor, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.